Hello and welcome to Average Emphasis Beer Reviewing. My name is Omanator and you are... Patry. And today we're reviewing... The, 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 the what? The old speckled Show end. camera. The other camera. <laughs> that camera. That this one. This camera? Yes. That camera. That camera. Um, <coughs> I'm not very good with change. Um, <laughs> fucking conservative. No. Alright. The old speckled hand. It's really... It's a really typical British beer, so I suppose we're just gonna tr try it. Yeah, go. British I accent, stop. I just did that to introduce the beer. Just okay, it's an ale, and it has a very, very nice color. Yeah, it's kind of a rose orum thing. Orum. Yeah, that that's, that is a color description. I'm pretty sure, isn't it? Yeah, it helped me here, audience. That went far away. No, okay. <laughs> the old speckled hen. Typical British beer. Not much to say, really. Except it comes in a nice bottle. Like the label looks good. The, the label looks good. That's all I have to say. That's. I'm out of ideas. Yep. We're calling it. No. Okay. Show it to the camera. Always. I think we should trade spot now. Okay, so. it It's ale. Smells very much like an ale. It's yeah. an ale. Smells like a slightly weak ale. There's not like uh, that much taste in it. Let's see, uh, alcohol percentage 5.2. Yeah, it's an ale. Yeah. Or let's have a taste. Yeah, let's do that. Hmm. Well, there's a lot of um, um, like pepper liquorice thing. Yeah, it's a, it's a warm, it's a warm beer with a lot of solid base to its taste. Mm, very it's robust. Not, it's not sweet in the way that the Innocent Gun was. No. It doesn't have the innocent gun has that kind of you drink it first and then there's this flare of taste this kind of woo this one's a little more blocky yeah. it's like hey here's a beard you know, yeah it, it has the taste, taste like all the way through mm. it has that kind of spicy solid taste yeah very spicy little licorice a little bit of pepper it's better than I remember it being mm, it, it tastes pretty good um, it's not bad I think it's a little too alcohol sharp like the alcohol is a little too eh. Comes a bit much through, I guess you could say. Mm, just after the middle. Yeah, yeah. Just it's then like it comes just, and then it goes. There's just a taint of like that um, spirit. And then it comes and then it goes away. Yeah, it doesn't stick in your mouth forever, so that's always some. Um, it, it overall tastes pretty good. Mm, yeah, it's not bad. It's, um, I still wanted it to uh, wanted to eat it with the or blah, uh, drink it with these crisps we have. But I wouldn't let him. Because we never uh, ate crisps while on the show, do we now? No. Mm. no. Well, it was Except that fried pig skin, but that was... Yeah, yeah don't reaching. go there. Show the chips to the camera, bro. I no, can't. you know which one. <laughs> no, that? I actually don't. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, old oh. ladies. Yeah, old ladies. There's fucking old ladies on the chips. Like, and the their explanation for that is... Um, and then now I don't know about you, but when we see an eccentric old photograph like the one on the front of this bag, we can't help but... Yes, I know it's not a British accent. <laughs> it's just <laughs> generic pretentious. It's just what? <laughs> Sorry. No offense, it's just weird. I am now contemplating this bag of crisps. I'm now contemplating whether to open no. it. I'm just taking. Right. I was slightly too <laughs> disrespectful to the beer. To the beer? Can you be disrespectful to a beer? Yes, but to a like beer. This. America. And that's just disrespectful to anyone who's in the room. It's like a disrespectful room to my throat. That's why you do like when you smoke pipe, you mm. make a vacuum with the mouth instead of your fucking lungs, <laughs> dumbass. <laughs> I mean, if you do it with your lungs, like. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> yeah, sorry, exactly. sorry, I'll do it when I can breathe. <gasps> That's just weird, man. What the fuck? All right, let's rate this beer. It's not kind of, you know, uh, love child weird. Oh! <laughs> yes! <laughs> you know, uh, just what happens on SoundCloud stays on SoundCloud. <laughs> I hope so. No, it's probably gonna end up, end up on YouPorn. 
if those two songs end up on new point, I will be very scared. I will be very happy because then the goal has been reached. Um, very, very short resume. Um, um, two covers of uh, with a lot for my friends and everybody hurts respectively. Uh, with a very with me moaning, um, or not as much moaning as sing moaning. What were you saying? Everybody hurts. Yeah, and it was out of um, it wasn't like with the melody. It just went along somehow. It just didn't fit at all. I found out how simple that song is to play. I was just sitting around jamming. I was like, wait, 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 what the fuck? Isn't this everybody hurts? Just take a D and you go. Wait, no, no, wait, it's third song. Oh, yeah, I lost the low E string, so I'm confused. And then you change to a G, I think it was? No, it's not in tune, but you know. It's close enough. It's so fucking simple. It's just, it's such a bad song. And then. Ominator and Mr. Love Child were just moaning and screaming over the and We did thing. all live with two mics, we were just sitting like, yeah, in one mic, we're going, yes! Single take. Um, Love Child did one very memorable, yeah! Yeah. <laughs> it was really good. Alright, let's rate this goddamn beer. This goddamn beer, motherfucker! Alright. <clears throat> oh wait, did you notice that it has quotation marks on it? Yeah. The title? Old Spackalan. Wait, what the fuck is that about? It's because no, it's um, it seems as uh, I think I remember. Yeah, first brewed to commemorate uh, the fiftieth anniversary of the MG car factory, and affectionately named after an old MG car used uh, as a factory runaround, the old speckled one, old speckled one in um, uh, in a very British accent becomes old speckled one. Oh yeah, okay, I see what you did. There. All right, ratings. You go first, always. 83. Damn, you're generous today. Mm, generous today. I'm it broke the 80 mark? That's pretty... A the 85 mark is the magic one. Yeah, but the 80 mark is like, hmm, this beer's, this beer's good. It, yeah, it is. It's an it's an ale. It's um, mm. It doesn't break the 80 mark for me. It's too weird. Mm. And, uh, yeah, it's a little too mass-produced, a little too, um... Yeah. It's not, it's like, it's it's like it had a really good flavor, but then it was bottled for 300 years and then it lost a bit of it, you know? Yeah, I've, I've actually, now I'm thinking about it, I'll bump it down to an 80. 83 is a bit high now, you said. I think I'll give it a 70. Mm. No, 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 it deserves more than that, 73. I, I'll give it a 73, I like this beer, it tastes pretty mm. good, it's not bad. Uh, I don't think I would buy it again, it's too expensive, but mm. you know, if it was uh, on like really big sale stuff, I could probably grab one, sure. Mm. I'm an ale man again, as most of you know. And I like this one, so it get uh, it gets an eighty. Yeah. Okay. Well, um, and anything more to say about it? It's okay to say no. And you no. Don't have, and you don't have to make weird faces. Look, that's practically my gimmick. Without that, no one would care about having me on the you show. Just broke the fourth wall again. Okay. Look. Do I have to do this again? There is no fourth wall. I know. Hello, people. Yeah. We, we introduce every episode with hello people out there in YouTube land. I mean, what <laughs> fourth wall about that? Oh, is the fourth wall the floor or the ceiling? <laughs> yeah, cannabis, man. Um, you made say, that um, comment earlier today. It was funny. I think the audience is up there, yeah. Hello, audience. Welcome out there. No. Okay. Thank you for watching. My name is Ominator. This right here is... Paintry. And we are average emphasis beer reviewing. Tune in next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>